I am very pleased to be here to announce the Physical Sciences uh, Prize winner. Physical Sciences, as you all may know, consists of physics, chemistry, earth sciences, few other things under the Physical Sciences. Let's see who the winner would be this time. It's none other than G. Ravindra Kumar, who is a senior professor, Tata Institute of Fundamental Research, TIFR Mumbai. Professor G. Ravindra Kumar is being awarded for his pioneering experimental contributions to the physics of high-intensity laser matter interactions, in particular for providing, for the first time, unequivocal evidence of turbulent magnetic fields and the discovery of terahertz frequency acoustic waves in laser-produced hot, dense plasmas. These results have significance to testing stellar and astrophysical scenarios. Now let's hear uh, the message from Professor Srinivas Kulkarni, the jury chair. Professor Ravindra Kumar, congratulations on winning the 2015 Infosys Prize in Physical Sciences. Your work on plasma physics has had a global impact with applications ranging from terrestrial to astrophysical locales. The panel was very pleased that experimental physics is, be is being recognized by the Infosys Prize. We very much hope you'll be a role model for youngsters. Your work is a vivid demonstration of both the importance and the joys of undertaking experimental investigation of nature. I'm particularly pleased that your work has helped me, an astronomer, finally understand how neutron stars are born. And uh, here is the reaction from uh, the winner, Professor Ravindra Kumar. I'm so struck by this. Uh, thank you so much for this recognition, which is you know, I owe it to all my exceptionally bright students and very enthusiastic generous colleagues who have worked with me over the years. Well, I accept this on their behalf. It's a, even a bigger challenge for me to live up to the expectations that this prize places on me. And I hope, sincerely hope that I will live up to it in the future. And uh, my students and I will continue to work on this. Thank you.